going to pause one minute. Yeah, I'm not doing that. Because anybody that freaking watches this is going to see the password. And that's no good. I'll do that later. Should have done that before I was broadcasting. Alright. Save one play. That'd be interesting. I'm going to eat because I am still eating. That's right. Eating, playing, stream up. I don't care. Kingslayer, oath breaker, brought to his knee. He tells it. Lord Forrester's sword won't thin itself, you know. Make sure it's spot. Now that is a proper sword. I'll have one like it myself someday. You? You'll never have a sword like that. I say that as a friend. Even if we're being honest. Oh, don't be an ass, Bowen. <laughs> Apologies, your lordship. I had Andy, you know. <laughs> and him what? Capturing him. He was nowhere near the Kingslayer at the Whispering Wood. He was so drunk, he barely made it out of his tent. Next, he'll tell us he caught Tyrion, too. <laughs> you think he's lying? No one never lets the truth stand in the way of a good story. You captured the Kingslayer. Aye. Ah. Well, I'd have handed it. Aye. A hand round his ankle as ten others took him down. <laughs> See? What did I tell you? I brought him to his knees. Lord Forrester. But not before he dragged you halfway across the battlefield on your face. You're questioning <laughs> Norrin's honor. I'm questioning Norrin's story. This grows more far-fetched every time he tells it. Get your liege lord some wine. Go on. It's your job. Right, thanks. You're welcome. Thank you, Garrett. I'll do it. Norrin's family has faithfully served House Forrester for centuries. His honor is beyond reproach. And House Tully is forever in his debt. They've never seen a field plowed so well as the day the Kingslayer dragged... The night we celebrate. To Rob Stark, the king in the north! The, the king, 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 king in the north! Tomorrow, we march on Casterly Rock, and House Forrester has been given the greatest honor to lead the young wolf's army and ride as the vanguard! The gods have favored us. Onward to Casterly Rock! Aye! Death to the Lannisters! Aye! Iron from ice! Aye! Got it. Yes, my lord? I need you to keep an eye out for Roderick. As his father, I could not be more proud of the man he's become. On a night like this, men find false courage at the bottom of their cups. I'd rather he were here. Yes, my lord. There's also the question, what's to be done with you? It's been on my mind for a while now. Something must be done. With me, my lord. You've served House Forrester well for several years now, but I can't expect you to squire forever. How shall I reward your loyalty? What can I offer you? 
It served me well. To bring honor to House Forrester, my lord. You have more honor than those who were born to it. There were those who had their doubts when your uncle put forth your name as my squire. But you've erased those doubts entirely. It would be an honor to see you riding by Roderick's side in the vanguard tomorrow. Not as a squire. I want to buy a PlayStation camera, because then you can see my face while I stream. It's well deserved, Garrett. Thank you, my lord. I promise. I won't let you down. That I don't doubt. But for now, keep this between us. We're celebrating tonight. I wouldn't want the other squires to feel discouraged. Yes, my lord. Now go, and find Roderick if you can. I will, my lord. Thank you. Bloody hell. Squire! Fetch us more wine! Can you give me a hand? Come on. Can I get up to you? Yeah, no problem. I have been a squire longer than you. So? I outrank you. You should help me. It's fine. Fetch more wine. Rub my armor, clean my boots. It's just my luck to end up with Norin while you serve the Lord. Let him fetch his own wine for once. You'd better watch your tongue, Bowen. It could be much worse. What the fuck do you know about it? Nothing is worse than Norin. See, that's where you're lucky. Low expectations. If I could always be worse. Big shit, shovel and slub. Maybe I'd think saddling his horse was the greatest honor in the seven. You hear me? Oh, yeah. All right. This beats pig farming. Who doesn't love bacon? Ah, pig farmers. <laughs> All I'm saying is... Believe me, in this world, in Game of Thrones, more than this, it could always be worse. The lowest of the low. For all I know, we could be squires for life. Pulling wine around a fucking wedding. What a waste of fucking time. Not me. What? Tomorrow I ride with Roderick and Lord Forrester. Sir Gerard the fucking great. Unbelievable. Maybe if my uncle were Castellan, I'd be getting promoted too. Who my uncle is has nothing to do with it. He's got Lord Forrester's ear, doesn't he? I'm sure it didn't hurt. Hey, um... It's right over there. Do me a favor, hang up, and I'm gonna try to play it on my iPad, because my iPad has a little kickstand. Go on. Time. You lot have drunk your share. Come on, Steph, hang up. <clears throat> In a generous mood. Let's give it a sec. Fucking phrase. Hold on. Nice night for a wedding. I just gotta look. Yeah, I know. Blah 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 blah. Not often he finds a willing husband for one of his daughters. Crap! I gotta, hold on. I gotta, I gotta log in. Give me a second. The hell's my Apple ID again? What? What's wrong? Just gotten into you. Yeah. Listen, I'm gonna call you. Stop that. Hang up. Wine. I am not carrying these by myself. Not a fucking chance. What's wrong? Racing doesn't like it. Something the matter. Bowen, we have to give it a rest. I'll call you back. Go if you're in such a rush. We have to warn the others. Good luck. That's good. I'll get a charge and figure it out later. my volume on my phone so you're gonna have to I'm not gonna it's going back feedback <clears throat>
problem with this game is that you've got um, very, very quick responses. I'd do that again. That was the wrong direction. <laughs> the problem with this game is that you have very fast responses. Like I said, it needs to be quick. Takes me a few tries to get this right. Hold up. sucks. Come on, come on! Sixteen hundred pound animal. Got it. Did you find Roderick? Speak up, Garrett. The Freys. They they slaughtered him, my lord. Well, I'm glad you're getting a kick out of it. You didn't leave him, did you? What happened to him? I, I didn't leave him. But I couldn't save him. Find a weapon, quickly! You know, for a minute I thought he was gonna stick me. Cause that look on his face, I was all like, uh, <laughs> like, uh, it wasn't me who stabbed you. We have to keep moving, my lord. I'd never make it. They'll hunt us down like dogs. All the phrase says time's over. <gasps> Oh, that's an artery. Guard this with your life. Return it to Ironrath, where it belongs. Really? There's no time to waste. I'll be damned if I let it fall into the hearts of those traitors. <coughs> have to go. You're welcome to the fucking torch. I will do as you command, my lord. 
You have served me well. I know I can count on you. Tell your uncle. <laughs> Tell him. The North Grove must never be lost. Tell no one but him. Do you understand? You must swear. Tell o Give me a second. I let the dog out. Your uncle Duncan, the future of the house may depend on it. <coughs> Will, my lord. Hey, it's those foresters. Oh, I like this. This is fun. And there's six episodes, by the way. Kill those fucking foresters. Just so you know. We love to be free. I don't know how long the episodes are. I hope it's halfway decent. Excellent. Coolio. Makes me appreciate uh, Game of Thrones a little more. Since I have direct uh, effect on the story, as it were. Yesterday I got like just under six hours of sleep. Seems to be the typical now. I left a you watch, all this is gonna do is make me want to go and watch the TV show again. <laughs> and we'll be like, oh yeah, let's go binge watch. And then I stay. Huh? What'd you say to me? Catch up? I'm still on season one. <laughs> two, sorry. Beginning of two. Five. Shut up. <laughs> like I said, do me a favor. Keep, him, keep uh, an eye for, out for a cheap PlayStation camera. Because when that's properly plugged in, you can actually see my face on your screen broadcasting, which is kind of how it's supposed to be. But I don't have one yet. He's like, I'm permanently unhappy. I have a permanent frown plastered to my face. Lay down, Bryson. Yes. White balls. Lay down. Lord Bolton better give us fucking titles for this. Winter may be coming, but at least still have us bacon. Long boy, there's nothing for you here. <coughs> Father, I said move on. Unless you want to get fed to the fucking pigs. I recognize you. You're a forester squire. Former Stark bannermen have no claim on land anymore. Or haven't you heard? The Starks are dead. Where'd you get that sword? Not a chance that sword is his. Must have stolen it. Out here by himself. Probably a deserter. Ah, I, I killed a man for it. Did you? Now why don't I believe you? 
Should be interesting. Watch me fail this crap a couple times. Yeah, I knew that was a great sword. I was like, there's no way. My land. This is Bolton land now, boy. Lord Bolton is the new warden of the north. I reckon he like a proper lordly sword like that. Shit. I see. No. I'll have that. He's been sword. stabbed in the gut. You can hear the freaking blood in his lungs. Come get it, you bastard. Finish this fucking pig farmer. Pathetic. You really are a pig. Well, that's one. <clears throat> Two to go. for those that commit murder. I, I have a family. They'll never survive without me. I have no quarrel with you. Kill him. No, please. <laughs> Lord Whitefield will see you hang for this. That must Justice. Happen. No mercy. <laughs> Not in this universe. Crimes like that typically in any civilized culture. Garrett, Death penalty. You survived. <laughs> Your sister. <laughs> she hid. See, I'm an ethicist. Only fucking actions that have a justifiable response. I tried to stop. Mercy. That. There's no predicting that. So, justice. Lovely. I'll kill the men who did this. Oh, absolutely. Disembowel him like a stuck pig. It's Garrett! Get the Castellan! Tell him his nephew survived! Garrett! I was too late. They were already dead. Bring the Maester! Meet us in the Great Hall! Quickly! I didn't hear what you said. Two White Hill soldiers and a Bolton. They killed my family. And for what? My sister, she. She was only eight years old. This never would have happened with the Starks in power. It's unimaginable, unacceptable. You have my condolences. Thank you, Mister. I'm just grateful that the stream is uh, fairly stable. The blade cut deep, but I should be able to save your leg. Your justice was swift. Some will call it vengeance. No doubt the White Hills will claim it was murder. It was your family. I can't say I would have done any different than you. I'd do it again if I had the chance. If we don't respond with strength, they won't stop until they have everything. These maggots ought to help prevent infection. Hold the wound open for me, would you? Uh, 
Ouch. Oh, God. Yeah, that's just... Oh, wow. <laughs> Although on the bright side, the maggots will prevent infection. These are dark days, I fear. To lose the lord of the house and the eldest son through such a despicable act of treachery and betrayal. Eat all the rotten tissue, leave all the healthy tissue. ...and hours have fallen in times such as this. The late Lord Forrester was a good man. And poor Roderick. A serious man, but he would have made a good lord. Roderick and Lord Forrester. We can avenge them. And attack House Frey. Now is the time to find allies, not enemies. The future of this house is in Lord Ethan's hands now. Fly flew over Rayson's head and he just goes... ...prepared to lead. <sighs> oh, right. so eat it. Right. Uh, this might hurt a bit. Hold this for me, will you? I understand from your uncle that Lord Forrester saved your life. He did. Rather odd, though, that he chose to save you, his squire, and not his son, Roderick. Roderick was already dead. He couldn't handle himself. He was as good with a sword as any man I've seen. He gave me a message to deliver. A message? About what? What did he tell you? Get my uncle. I was told only to tell him. Your uncle? I see. Must be rather important, then. Lady Forrester will be here any moment now. I'd like you to walk for me first, to see if you can put any weight on that leg. Uh. Go on. Don't stop now. It's better to let the blood circulate. The Ironwood Grove. Ironwood. It's probably black oak. Can't think of a wood that's harder than that. Well, it's a PS4, so it would be assumed. This might help. Rather cute little creatures, aren't they? Maggots. Interesting. Might come in handy. UK line of bed now. Asher. Exiled to Essos, unfortunately. Talia and Ethan. I suppose Lord Ethan now. Lady Forrester. She's always been kind to me. Treated me like I was a Forrester myself. Mira. Still in King's Landing, I suppose. Although, I wonder if they'll bring her home. The interesting thing is lately I've been playing Elder Scrolls, easy being the fourth born and Elder Scrolls is very similar to King of, uh, Game, of, Game of Thrones. Forrester, you play the game. Even the maps look, looks extremely similar. Gregor the Good. 
they have a, uh, a kingdom called Winterhold. It's kind of interesting. Mm -hmm. I may be mistaken. You do seem able to put weight on it. Not some lame horse you get to put down. Did your leg feel weak? No. I just wanted to ask you. Why do the White Hills hate the foresters? I think it's safe to say the feeling is mutual. There's been enmity between the two houses for as long as anyone can remember. I don't doubt someone killed someone, which led to more killings of someone's, and then, well, here we are. Who is the new lord of House Forester? Why, Ethan, of course. At the Citadel, I swore an oath to serve whichever noble house I was assigned. Advising the late Lord Forester was an honor. Advising Ethan, his third-born son, is challenging. There's still so much he has to learn, yet the very fate and future of this house rests in his hands. Which is rather frightening when you think about it. The White Hills want Forester Ironwood. Ah, they'd take it all if we'd let them, especially now with the Boltons in power. And proceed to clear-cut every last inch of it until there's nothing left. Just as they've done before. What will happen to me now? Excellent question. Hmm. Under normal circumstances, you could join Sir Roiland and his men. Although, given the circumstances of your... circumstances, it becomes a bit tricky, doesn't it? I suppose it will be for Lord Ethan to decide. Lord Forrester promoted... Circumstances of your I'm circumstances. I'm no longer a squire, if that matters. It might, I suppose. But I'll defer to Lord Ethan on this. Can I see Ethan? Is he here? He is. But I'm afraid he's indisposed at the moment. He prefers not to be disturbed while practicing his loot. Can I go now? I believe your leg will be fine. Any time will tell, but... Lady Forrester. Welcome home, Garrett. We're all relieved to know you survived. Thank you, my lady. Talia asked to see you. Garrett, I heard what happened. Is it true? Your family... Dead. I'm so sorry. Me too. Off to bed now. Hurry on. Garrett was just telling me how valiantly Lord Forrester fought to the end, even when all was lost. I'm sure Lady Forrester would like to know. He saved my life, my lady. Yet not Roderick's. You were with Roderick, no? I'm sure it was chaos and confusion. But if you can remember anything... He... He fought valiantly, my lady. Of course he did. He was House Forrester's best. This has been so incredibly difficult for us. Especially the children. But I was told... I was told you were the last to see my husband alive. Yes, my lady. I know it may be difficult to remember, but if I may ask... Was there anything he said? Any last words before he passed? He said he loved you. That's very kind of you to say. You have the Forester's sword. Ethan should have it, now that he is Lord. Lord Forrester asked me to return it to the house. He said this is where it belongs. With his family. Thank you, Garrett. Of course, my lady. They demand a response. It's too dangerous. I suppose in a way it's similar to Japanese culture where the way you remember someone is by returning their sword. I'll be sure it's given to Ethan. Duncan, this was our land. They were our people. Your family. I share your outrage, Sir Royland. I do. But now is not the time to provoke the White Hills. Not with Ramsay Snow coming to see us bend the knee. The hell with Ramsay Snow, the bastard. Garrett, you understand what this means. You killed a Bolton, and Ramsay Snow will want his retribution. 
We're the ones who should be demanding retribution. They killed my family. And they'll pay for what they've done. That much, I promise. But now is not the time for vengeance. It's not now. When? We have to be smart. Ramsay Snow will be here within the week. And what would you have us do? Nothing. I would have us use our heads, while they're still attached to our shoulders. Garrett has lost as much as anyone else within these walls. Maybe you can talk some sense into your uncle. Garrett's suffered enough already. You asked too much of the boy. He deserves to be heard. My uncle's right. We need to be smart. Smart. Eddard Stark was smart. And look where that got him. So, what's to be done? <sighs> Ultimately, it will be for Lord Ethan to decide. He's just a boy who can barely hold a sword. He knows nothing of how to lead men. He is the lord of this house, and he needs our help. It's bad enough the Boltons would have us bend the knee and swear fealty. But now, this. But I'll accuse you of murder, and us of protecting you. The boy was just defending himself. Fuck the Boltons. One of their men killed my family. Aye. You'll say it was justice. They'll say it was murder. It's just the excuse Ramsay Snow would need to put us to the torch and kill us all. I'd like to see them try. I'm afraid it's a risk we cannot take. Which is why you cannot stay. Cannot stay? But where would I go? The one place beyond the reach of even House Bolton. You're sending him to the wall? The you fucking crazy. Not, not in the eyes of the Boltons. Send him to the wall. I'm afraid it's the only oh, oh, lovely. Oh, great. When the house is so vulnerable. I'm fucking standing. That's that's a death sentence. I'm not a criminal. There'd be nothing we could do great. to protect you. To stay it's with great. the destruction upon us all. I know so that it continues. I know it's difficult to understand. I'll do what's asked. Of Hold on. I hear you. Fair, but it is what's best. Type the comments in. I can't hear you. Doesn't matter. That settles it then. You can have my horse, and I'll see you have plenty of food. But we haven't much time. It's YouTube. As long as it's not explicit, it should be fine. Oh, well, thanks for the spoiler. No more of that. Word up to me. I gladly take a sword through Lord Whitehill's heart. If You're gonna bang the snow critter, or whatever, dude. The gods will ensure <laughs> I will. But for now, I have House Forrester to consider first. I know you're not a criminal, but Lord Forrester would be proud that you're putting the interests of the house ahead of your own. Many of you. Castle Rock and, and I at Roderick's side, but. It was well deserved, Garrett. You worked hard and served your lord with honor. I've been waiting for the right moment to tell you. What? Lord Forrester asked me to give you a message. He said, The North Grove can never be lost. Sorry. You caught me by surprise. It's not often discussed, if ever. He said, tell only you. For good reason. Most don't even know it exists. They think it's just a myth made up by wildlings and fools, and it's better kept that way. I assume you kept your word. You haven't told anyone else, have you? This is important, Garrett. Of course not. I told no one. Well done. Lord Forrester was right to put his trust in you. From this day forward, this will be our secret. But soon, I may need your help. But I can't say anything more just yet. Just know the North Grove may very well be vital to the future of this house. But don't breathe a word of it to anyone at the wall. I think Before I killed the bug. If you can, it will help. Oh, oh, nope. No, I didn't. <clears throat> Come here. <sighs> Die, you little shit. I I kill, bug. Oh, Squish. Nice. Fine. The last of the killer flies dies. Your actions at the wall will reflect the honor and dignity of the house. I'll serve with honor. 
I know you will. I would. Wouldn't be proud of it. It would be unfortunate. Rise to the occasion, as it were. Garrett, wait! Be safe. Characters I control, if it's just him or if there are others. Well. And if he was smart, he would reveal himself. What? I don't like this game anymore. Maybe something happened to him. Ethan's fine. He's just forgotten this is a game. I win! Congratulations, your lordship. Don't worry. It's just a game, Ryan. A stupid game. I don't like it. He was worried you were gone. I thought we'd never find you again. I'm right here. And I promise, I'm not going anywhere. I wish Mira was here. And Asha. And... and Roderick. I do too. But Mira's in King's Landing and... Can't she come home? I don't want her to die too. Ryan, she's perfectly safe, I promise you. I don't want Gerd to die either. Maester Ortengren said... He got sent to the wall. I'll miss Garrett. He was nice. Garrett is strong. He can take care of himself. No one will tell me what Garrett did, but it must have been serious. I heard Duncan and Sir Royland talking. They said someone will come here looking for revenge. Everyone's worried about me. I'm actually half tempted to show you, um, Who the other scrolls. About me? Well, Sir Royland for one. He says you can't fight very well. What? And he calls you a milksop. Sir Royland forgets himself. I don't care what he says. I can protect you. What does milksop mean? I don't know. But I know it's not good. Terminate this stream. Load up an Elder Scrolls stream and keep an eye out because it'll pop back up again, okay? Born yet. We had so much fun. Oi. And, well, and everything changed. Oh. Roderick became so...